Welcome back for some more Deep Rock Galactic Survivor, and we're going to do an Impact Axe run, where we load up heavy on it, and I've had people say this weapon's great, other people say this weapon's trash, so I'm going to test it. We're Hazard 3 on the Magma Core. I am still sick, so uh, I might have to stop a couple times, so you might notice a couple cuts in the video. So just uh, bear with me here, we're going to go in and we're going to have some fun. I usually try to do my videos all in one shot, but uh, being sick, it's a little bit tougher. Let's have a look at the stats on this thing. Take the damage right out of the gate. So it's got decent damage. The reload time... So I think the reload time is really where you want to get, right? You want to get that down lower. It is explosive. I kind of like the weapon. It'll just be interesting to see. So we're going to go reload time. It'll just be interesting to see if you go heavy on it. Put those damage numbers on. See if we can get this thing going. Even, even to be able to beat Hazard 3 with it. I have a feeling it's going to struggle. You can make it leave a trail of fire or a trail of acid, I think. With the... Uh, Overclocks. We definitely don't want anything to outshine it, so we gotta be careful with the weapons that we choose. Gotta find one more bloom. Well, if we're not if we don't want anything to outshine it, we're gonna take this, because I think this one's gonna get a video to itself too, because I think this is a really bad weapon, so we're gonna take it. I keep on forgetting about that grenade, but in my opinion, it's one of the worst weapons in the game that I've seen, anyway. So it deserves a, it deserves a video all to itself. If you want to see more Deep Rock Galactic Survivor, make sure you subscribe to the channel. We have played a ton of this game here. It's been it's such a fun game. I love covering it. And we've got a new update coming. Very excited to see this new update. More damage. Again, it's not going to be optimized. I know that the uh, kinetic would have been the better choice there, but we're going to get this thing up to a high level and see how well it can perform. Now, is fire rate really something that matters for this thing? It's a stat that shows. I'm concerned that if I take this, it's, it's going to backfire on me. That's my concern. So I don't really know. I don't think I'm going to take that. I don't want to lose the movement speed. It could be good, though. Maybe. Well, there's only one way to find out, but... We're not going to take it. I'm not going to gamble it. I don't like losing all the movement speed anyway. Reload speed. Okay, so we can increase the damage or whatever, or we can leave a trail of acid. We're going to leave a trail of acid. I think that alone can make the weapon a little bit better. It doesn't change the damage type. But we have to keep that in mind. It doesn't make it an acid weapon. It stays as kinetic. Here, we'll take the crit chance. I'm going to go reload speed again. I want to get this thing really, really firing off. some nitro. We need to make sure we get all this stuff mined out for us. That hit pretty good. I know we're only on hazard 3. I just didn't know what difficulty to play it on. I feel like hazard 5, I definitely lose, right? Maybe you could do hazard 4, though. That's why I went up in difficulty on the map, too. Instead of going caverns, we went magma core, because I thought maybe this would be fair. I'm gonna go with this. Ooh. 
just want the doctor. Throwables are tricky, though, because you can't aim, right? Like, you're not able to really control where you're going to toss your weapon. Threat level keeps increasing. You need to work faster. Just want the doctor. He should die. There we go. Make the move speed. Damage. Okay, again, I don't want it. I don't want anything to outshine it. I think this is a really good weapon. This is also a really good weapon. We'll take this. I think the Sabata as a level one isn't going to be crazy. Gather up your beard and hatches shut, taking you to stage. Off we go. Well, we got through the first area. Okay, so we're definitely going to take the. We're definitely going to take more reload speed. We'll have to check the stats in between. Um, I always have to buy a little bit of health. Now let's roll. Nothing for me here. Let's try. We can take. This actually can work, right? This can work on our on our weapon. I don't want to go kinetic damage though. I'll throw that boosts all of our weapons. Oh well. And we'll take this as well. Yeah, that's fair. That's okay. Now let's have a look at the stats. Yeah, so our reload speed is really good. I'm curious though if I really should have maybe taken the fire rate. Like I don't know how the weapon really functions that way. I'm trying to get it so that I can have more axes out. But maybe, maybe, maybe I should have taken the fire rate. Huh. Right now, we're I'm kind of having three. The fire rate doesn't seem to be an actual upgrade that gets offered for this weapon. Maybe that would just be the time between throwing the axes that we're allowed to have. You know, like maybe that's all that is. It would maybe just cut down the, the time between chucking a new axe. Yeah, probably. Yes, Not gonna necessarily give it give us more. So maybe now we just need to go heavy into damage. Come on, more kite. I felt like it was taking forever for me to mine it. Yesterday was the first day, I think, since this game released, that I didn't put out a new video, because I was that sick. And it sucked. It really sucked, but, uh, you know, I can't control these things. Take the XP gain. I know it's not great, but we'll take it. I mean, we are... We're taking things down here, right? But it is it is still very early. We're still only, you know, second level. We aren't dealing with massive swarms yet. I have a feeling Area 4 is going to be a problem. And that's some serious fall off. Um, when we take damage, we'll take this. Okay. Um, let's take weapon range. All right, we can throw the axes further now. Pickup radius is always nice. I don't know what I can do to really, other than just picking up more damage. It just doesn't feel like this weapon is that effective as a main.
Maybe I'm wrong, but it doesn't feel great. Want to try and find some more stuff to mine out. Um, so explosive damage applies to everything, but we'll take this. It applies to two of our weapons. Let's see, here we are. In this, I'm in. Yeah, I don't know. This might be tough. Area two. I'm already on the ropes. Reload. I wonder if reload. Still trying to figure out exactly how that works with us. I guess it's just like the time between when when our axes come back and when we throw the new ones out. Okay. This is this is not looking good for us. Yeah, this might actually be one of the worst weapons that I've tried to do this with. I'm trying really hard here. I think it's clearing the, cr the crowd pretty decent. We're going to take this. This is going to help us. Right? This will help. We should actually do a cryo cannon video as well. I know it's very, very similar to the CRISPR, but cryo cannon might actually be better. Just because it actually can freeze enemies. There we go. All right, area two. We're there. Beauty. That elite never stood a chance. I will see to now it's going to start getting a lot harder, though. Oh, we've got some good options here, don't we? We're definitely going to take this. this now, we have some options. We can go reload speed. I think that's... Well, actually, let's go damage. Damage, damage. Crit chance and kinetic damage. Like this. Um, let's shake it up. Nothing there. Nope. Where's my axes? One more roll. Mm, what else? Nice. All right, that's huge. I already feel stronger. Area three. Here we go. Your mission is clear. Get to it. If you're still here at this point in the video, thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't liked the video, it helps a ton with the algorithm. Let's see if we can get a win with this weapon. I. Still, I have my doubts. I thought, going in, I thought for sure this was going to work, but. It's just a really, really slow and clunky weapon. Yeah. Hmm, not looking great. Blow all this up so I don't accidentally blow myself up later. Well, I, yeah, I think I've only ever really used the axe one time before. And in that video, I felt like it was really, really good, but maybe I'm wrong. Well, this is, this is good for us. We actually got some luck here. I mean, it, the radius, maybe it's good. I don't know, but we're taking damage. You don't really see any kind of an explosion when it goes off. That's the thing, right? Here we go. Clip size. Increases the amount of... Okay, so... The thing is, it doesn't even tell you what the clip size is on this. That's where I was confused. Okay. But I think now we can have six axes. Alright, okay. 
Now let's see how effective it is. Maybe now we start to do some serious work. Um, ooh, that's nice. I do apologize if my uh, commentary isn't as on point as it normally is. But I'm doing the best I can. Typical Canadian, right? Apologizing for things that aren't really in his control. Um, yeah, we'll take that. Reload speed. We'll take throwable damage. It's a good thing that we get more axes on that overclock, that's for sure. That's gonna make I think that will make a big difference for us. Gotta find some more some more materials. Some gold, a little nitra. There's some nitra. You're already here. Huh. Well, we'll take that. I think we're going to end up killing this boss quickly. Level 21 Axe. Take the mining speed. Do we not have a artifact somewhere here that we need to pick up? How does affect damage? Take it. See, this is bad. He's already calling in, calling in for uh, backup. There it is. More damage. bad didn't kill him um i'm gonna take this i'm gonna take the squint we've got to take him out there it goes all the axes came back at the same time you gotta get out of here Level 24 axe. Plenty Not bad. Came from. Stage four is waiting for you, miner. Okay, uh, not much here that I really want. I might buy the health or armor. Hmm. I'll take the health. Nice. I'll take it. We're gonna roll rubble damage, kinetic damage. We're gonna take the axe reload speed, I guess. Yeah, we'll take the kinetic damage. And we'll hope for some axe upgrades. Ooh. Okay. I can use this. And I guess we're going to hold on. Okay. Here we go. Area 4. To shoot and work to be done. Look at the stats. I don't think we need any more reload time. I don't think we need anything other than damage at this point on that weapon.
maybe you could pull off Hazard 4 with this. I feel like it would be a bit of a trick. And that's always the thing, too, right? Like, Hazard 4, I might have been dead on, like, the second area. I'd rather not do that. Like, you know, start a video and then die in the second area just because, like, I'm going way beyond what the weapon can do. It does feel super clunky still. I mean, you're throwing an axe. I guess it should feel a little clunky. The swing's heading your way. Load up. Maybe we won't get uh, attacked by, like, a, a bug at the end that has, uh, you know... Took too many red, had drank too many Red Bulls or something before, before it appears. Chase us down. That was an interesting end to the last video I did. Getting chased down by a bug that I absolutely could not outrun. Uh, we'll go throwable damage. I mean, we're hitting for, you know, 1,500. Not bad. That was nice. Take the HP. We're going to need it. Uh, I'm going to take the crit chance. What's our crit chance at? 72? Ooh, this is going to be nice. I have put myself into a very bad spot. This is not good. Yeah, I've put myself in a corner here, and I am going to have to try and run out of it. Rubble damage. That was not good. That was not smart. I almost threw it by going down there. I don't think I'm going to pick that up early. Uh... Artifact, I think I'm going to save it for this guy. I think we're going to really, 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 really struggle at getting the getting the win here. It's going to be tough. Like, how am I supposed to kill the Dreadnought? I don't have single target damage really, right? So. Is there a mag? There's a magnet over there. We're going to circle back for that magnet. It may be risky, but we're going for it. Rejoice, Tom saw the magnet. I just became a better Medic. Reload speed. Now that guy's gonna die. Time's running out, Miner. We're beating him up. If we get paid to win, maybe we can pull this off. Something with damage? Um, I'm gonna take the pickle nitro. Well done. Drop pot has arrived. Get there now. We're gonna need the damage you. if we want to pull this off. Excellent work, miner. Stage complete. Onwards to stage five. Okay. No more damage. This is it. I guess we're gonna take this. We'll take the crit chance as well. I think we're going to keep our Nitro. Next. I think we should. Go, re uh, go more damage. I'm going to hold on to the Nitro. Yeah. We'll take the damage off of it. Heading into the final floor. 917 damage. That's not bad. There's a chance. There's a chance that we pull this off, guys. I 
I don't want to get too much nitro, though. Too much nitro will make it so I can't move. We took this guy in quick. Our movement speed right now is plus 11. Oh, that's nice. 5,000? I saw some 5,000s in there. I mean, if we're going to be hitting for 5,000 damage on, on an axe hit, that, that might be... Plenty. Oh, get the win. I need health. What the hell am I doing? Uh oh. I gotta go find some. Or else we're gonna just get we're just gonna get jumped on once and we'll be dead. That was no joke. We absolutely destroyed those guys. We can get paid a win on top of this. There's some health. If we can get paid a win now, we might be able to absolutely demolish the dreadnought. But we're gonna wait, we'll get the artifact, and then we'll wake the dreadnought up, see what happens. And fingers crossed, I can actually pull this off. Come on, pay to win. I did not get it, but I'm going to take this. That gives us lots of HP. I don't think I need... I don't think I should take more Nitro. I think that would be a bad idea. I think we wake him up. I think we just say, screw it, and we go for it. So hard. Because I can't aim the axes. Just chuck him at the dude. There we go. Hey, good morning. I've got a nice, clear, open area here for us to fight in. He's, he's going down. Kinda. Halfway dead? Not nearly as fast as I was hoping. It's kind of pushing me down in this corner here, and I don't want to be down here. I'd rather be up here. It's a little bit more in the open for us. I think we got this. Just have to hit one or two more axes on him and he's done. That was actually not bad. Okay. Maybe hazard four? I think I don't think so though. I think hazard three is probably Man, hazard hazard four would be really, really tough. Yeah, that would be that would be a hard one. But it, it, it performed okay. Not bad. Better than expected. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, 8,000 DPS? Yeah, not not crazy, right? Not 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 insane. We've seen way higher. Especially on the level 29 weapon. Guys, thanks for watching. If you want to see more Deep Rock Galactic Survivor, make sure to subscribe to the channel. I'll catch you on the next one. Have a fantastic day.